At least 136 tornadoes tore across the Midwest on Saturday. Compare that to the average of 163 we typically see across the country in April. Saturday's storms moved across parts of Kansas, Oklahoma, Iowa, and Nebraska. Beth Vaughn is live in Wichita with a look at the damage. Beth. Good morning to you, Curtis. We're coming to you from a neighborhood just southwest of McConnell Air Force Base. And I want to show you what these front lawns look like. It's just incredible what's been left behind. It's a very dangerous scene, actually. Many, uh, many pieces of splintered wood, sharp metal objects. So the folks who return to these neighborhoods today to do their second day of cleanup are going to have to be very careful. You know, wear gloves, also wear boots. Um, but they're going to, as you can see, have a lot, a lot of cleanup to do. An EF3 tornado. You know, came through here Saturday evening into Sunday, and we're told that no fatalities happened here. No one died, but 13, 17 people were hurt. Um, but you can see beside me here, this is when it comes down to, it, it feels like these are actual stories. We want to meet these people who live in these homes. Here's somebody's suitcase and, and atlas that are left behind by the tornado. So you can just imagine these folks' lives were just put on hold, and you know, it might be indefinitely, because sometimes the cleanup efforts for some of these natural disasters last week weeks and sometimes Curtis and Jajo even months. Yeah, absolutely. And Beth, you know, I mean, I think it's a huge testament to the people in Wichita having been prepared for these storms as they came through the fact that there are no fatalities. Are there reports of any injuries out there? Yes, yeah, 17 people were injured uh, so far. That's what we're being told. But you're right. People really did heed warning. And the governor, we heard him earlier in the show, just um, praised the people in this area for um, heeding warning, taking a, a tornado warning seriously, which is what the National Weather Service really helps folks do, especially here in Tornado Alley.